Something that like really blew my mind about this class was that like, for some reason all my life, things like ceramics seemed like, oh, really talented people make that, and I know nothing about that. That's a world that's so far away from me. But whenever I started actually making it myself, I realized like that world is very close to me and everyone else. It's very adjacent to what I do. And it's very possible for me to be a part of that. And I like doing a lot of things with my hands, so I wanted to do that also. It gets pretty messy, but it's really rewarding. We teach you how to work with clay. You know, we tell you what clay is, where it comes from, the type of, uh, you know, what types of clay there are, and the type that we use. And we teach you several different methods to, to do hand building of clay. A lot of people, when they think of ceramics, they think of, uh, of wheel thrown pottery. Uh, we, I do touch on that a little bit, but that's not the most important thing. The most important thing is actually working with the clay. With ceramics, usually it's with uh, clay. Um, we can make shapes out of uh, the clay with uh, however we want to make it and we also use the, the wheel uh, usually to make bowls or anything uh, hollow inside. Um, and then we also learn about how to make glazes. We have to find recipes for the glazes and they mix them up and we test some of them and then they use them on their pots. Sometimes uh, it'll be like a, a gray, but it'll come out a blue. Uh, it just depends on the kind of glazes you buy and the temperature that you're firing at in the, the, the kiln that we put them in. The ones right here in the front, all these are uh, made on the wheel. And then the fish in the front, those are handmade. These are slabs, which is something that we roll out with a, a rolling pin. And then we create our shape with that. Um, these are coils, this one and this one. They're both coils. Uh, that is made out of a, a long piece of uh, clay that we roll out. It really helps you just to like understand exactly how much you can create, what your potential is. and. It's really nice to just try to get into, to create something for the sake of creating and expanding your horizons. Like for the one that says, I eat sand, that one's a bit more, I guess, cryptic and strange. But I feel like that's kind of how I am in a lot of situations. Ceramics sort of like bridges, like it's a bridge between functionality and beauty and I sort of wanted to like try that for myself. I feel like the students enjoy it, and I, I personally love clay. So, you know, if you're interested in doing this sort of thing, please take the class, you know, sign up. We have, uh, we have it in the fall and the spring. We don't do summer classes. It takes too much time to do the work, but you know, feel free to ask questions. You can come by and visit my class anytime.